So thanks for watching, it's Glow Bear, and today is day 10 of Break the Stigma Challenge, and today's question is, do you feel supported by your family? Um, and it's interesting, this is actually present day Glow Bear, this is not from the Instagram challenge, because for some reason I didn't have it saved, um, but it's an interesting question. And I think that to some extent, yes, I do feel supported by my family, but in some ways um, there are certain things that my family doesn't understand. Um, not many people in my family struggle with the same things, um, like depression especially. Um, anxiety, I think some of my family members understand it, but um, when I have an anxiety attack or things like that, my pretty much my best option for when I have an anxiety attack around family members is to kind of just leave the area um, because it's hard for people to understand in general. If you don't go through it and if you don't have experience with anxiety, um, a lot of times people will just be like, calm down, and that's really not helpful. Um, and I think the best example is we recently went on a trip to Florida for Christmas, and I was having really, really bad anxiety uh, pretty much the entire time. Um, and I got to the point where I could just feel like a champagne bottle getting ready to pop that I was going to have kind of a freak out. Uh, freak out's not the best way to say it, but essentially it was an anxiety attack. Um, I mean, it was. It, it, not essentially. Um, and... It happened right in the middle of everyone, and I felt so dramatic in having to explode and then just be like, I need a moment and walk away. And so I did that. I exploded, and then I walked away. Um, and when I say exploded, I was just like, I need a minute, and then boom, I was out of there. But... Um, it doesn't feel good to have to do that. Um, it felt bad, and unfortunately, I don't feel like it's something that uh, a lot of people understand because a lot of the times it seems like, I think especially for women, I think people get the stigma that, oh, she's just really uptight, oh, she just needs to chill out, or oh, she's crazy, um, but that's not the case. It's a lot of the times so much more complex than that, so I'm still working on how to handle that, especially around my family. Um, but yeah, so I don't know if that really answers the question. Uh, it's mostly my way of answering it is to say I'm still struggling with that. Um, and it's not that they're not supportive. Um, it's just, it's hard for them to understand. So I think there are certain things that they are super supportive of. Um, and that's not even necessarily that they aren't. It's just that I'm having a hard time managing it around them. So yeah, um, I think a lot of the times, too, people who are struggling with this, and this is my own experience, I feel guilty for having this and or for dealing with this and for having to explode and walk away and spend time by myself because I can't handle um, dealing with my family or dealing. That's not what I meant, but not being able to calm down on my like in a situation and having to separate my, myself, especially at the holidays, made me feel guilty. But at the same time, that's how you have to, that's how it works and that's how it works for me right now. So um, I know a lot of people struggle with that. And um, yeah, so thanks for watching day 10 and uh, I hope you're enjoying these.